Hello guys, it's Vishek from Ready Study Digital. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can add a preloader to your Divi site. A preloader is a small animation which is shown to the visitors of your website while the content of your page is still loading. For this tutorial, I have set up this dummy website with a picture of my team and a few videos from my YouTube channel. So, why you need a preloader? A good animation can keep the eyes of the visitors busy while the content is loading up. This enhances user experience and user engagement. This website currently don't have any preloader. If I refresh the page then you'll see that the reload is completely plain. Before we get started you should have your own preloader ready in GIF format. You can create a GIF in Photoshop or you can generate a preloader GIF online. Recently I came across this website. I really like it as this website offers many preloaders for free. If you want you can buy premium preloaders as well. It's totally up to you. The link of this website is in the description. You can select your desired preloader and edit it with the help of these settings available. Once you're done, you have to click on this download as GIF button and then click on free download. I have already downloaded my preloader, so I'll just close this. And let's now head back to WordPress dashboard. Here you need to upload the preloader file that you have downloaded just now. Head over to media and upload. My preloader GIF is right over here. Now go to the Divi theme options and scroll down to Divi CSS options. In this field, you need to upload this bit of CSS code. This code is available in the corresponding blog post. I have linked the blog post in the description of this video. Copy and paste the code. In this code, you can see that here is a place where you can paste the link. You need to copy the URL of your GIF and paste it in the provided place. Once it's done, scroll up and go to Integration tab. In this tab, you need to copy and place the JavaScript code in the head section. and the other code in the body section. Just hit save. Now let's check the front end of our website. As you can see the preloader is working fine. Please let us know in the comments if this method works for you. If you face any problem then please let us know in the comments we will try to get back to you as soon as possible. Make sure you subscribe to this channel as we are going to publish more awesome tutorials like this in future. Bye bye and have a nice day.